anyways, so it's not working anymore. Oh hi Donna, I'll be right back, okay. So it's not working anymore, I don't know why. Attempt to call place based no one listening to the phone instead. It didn't do that before. I don't know why it started doing it suddenly. Why is it doing this suddenly? So that doesn't work. And that is here. So all the thing that we've Hi Ocean, hello, thank you for looking. Hope you're having a good day. <coughs> So all the things we did last time, I broke it somehow, even though I didn't even touch it. Yeah, you were first, we know. Congratulations. So everything's broken, and I don't know why. Okay, if I delete that, is it gonna be okay? You got your piano? Oh my god. Congratulations! Thank you. Go play some games now. Not games. Go play some music. <laughs> you go be a musician, Dama. That's so cool. That's really nice. I'm happy for you. Okay, so it's playing now, but it doesn't play the way it used to play. I also bought the wrong mini cable. Yeah. Oh, no, it worked. Oh my gosh. What did I. Wait, what? Where are you gone? Oh, it's broken now. Oh, it's broken now. He doesn't like the fact that I have animations, I feel like. You got the wrong mini cable? It feels like everybody who's ever buy bought something. I just bought it with the wrong MIDI cable Cause I have no idea what a MIDI cable is And what it do But I know that people when they buy stuff They always message I got a wrong MIDI cable So that's okay Dama, it means that you're like everyone else You're like a normal musician <laughs> Hopefully you can get a MIDI cable <coughs> Or is it my die? I always see MIDI in my head like Wi-Fi. <laughs> I used to say Wi-Fi, and now I say Wi-Fi. Cause I don't know, the eye is kind of annoying, you never know how to use it. I bought the one for older panel models. I needed a USB B. Well isn't isn't it USB C nowadays? So that means you can't play it yet? Okay, so that's the stuff that I did. I thought that if I do this, it would work. But now I'm doing it, it breaks. So the spawner still works. I don't think I have any issues with this. I think it's with the animations that there's an issue how about instead of doing this I try Let's do 
ever find. Ah, oh, always a big S. Can't assign any value to a constant. Okay, so I don't want this to be a constant then. Okay, should I just get rid of that? So if I do... Because you know what the store is! It's right there. Equal height. No. Why, why should I? It's not... USB-C is a different data transfer cable. Anyways, I have some work to do at work. Okay, good luck, thank you. Have fun, Dama, with your work. <coughs> so I think there's one thing that I'm having issue with, with doing. <coughs> oh my gosh. I'm not sick. My throat is just suddenly deciding to suck. for the six levels I have what it takes to make a fun game I think a little bit of a fun game I remember that game that Lopo told me about the devil level devil level I think is why it is that one was so much fun that was crazy how fun it was and it was on the simplest levels right although now that I think about it it wasn't that simple because there was a lot of like gravity and stuff going on and like instance and stuff but here okay so if input is action press attack and but you keep telling me that star is not a thing but star is a thing please come on because it's right here how do i make the star thing be a thing in here If I do var store equal, but it, it when I try to do that, it came around as a constant, and I haven't seen the constant stuff in the tutorial stuff that I've done. Even though I do, I did a lot of tutorial stuff that I don't even need for that for my like games. I'm losing my time doing stuff that I don't understand for a thing that I don't want to do. I try that. Somehow this is not <laughs> why it should be broken. This is not it shouldn't be okay. Okay, clicking does nothing. Um because there's no there's nothing so okay that makes sense can i do now hide it's not allowed in sudden expression does it have to be constant preload I want to tell the star to do something, but it's not listening to me. How do I make you listen? I have cookies. I have cookies. Come on, listen to me now. I just burped, and I'm glad that you didn't hear, because I'm really good at hiding it. Um. If input is action is pressed and then we do two commas 
it should be considered as an attack. So, it's attack equals. But he doesn't know what star is. Why does you know what star is? I mean, star, it's over there. Oh my god. You know what I'll do? Um, let's say it's this. And wait for me here. <coughs> um, let's, let's try and steal some of the code. forever to load this one. Okay. So how did you make so that's the other project that I did, right? It's kind of broken too by the way. Like, because this course the game starts whether I clicked ready or not. I'm very good at that game, by the way. <laughs> it's kind of cute. I made it cute. Cause I should say 10% more. I've made pink. <laughs> Anyways, um. <coughs> So we had four skins. So we have the player area 2D. It's not even a sprite 2D, it's an area. The player is an area. Should I do an area? The mob. Exports, mobs in, packs in. Score. Is that necessary if it's void and passed? Called every frame delta is the elapsed time since the previous one. Maybe that's because I'm not doing that in the right scene. So if I want something to do with the store, I should do it in the store. Obviously. Oh my gosh. Seriously? Obviously. Can I just switch project here? No. Okay. I think I was being very stupid though. All I gotta do... Oh, that's annoying that I have to close and open. That's okay. I have to be in the right script to begin with. So let's just be in the right script. Creep, that's why. Okay, we're gonna do that pass here. Oh, I should have copy pasted it. <laughs> Don't remember. Wait, what was it? <coughs> okay, I've got here. <coughs> Store. Okay. <coughs> process delta. Or process. I don't know. Oh, damn it. I know that has something to do with vectors. So maybe I don't need to do anything in here. Okay, let's just do it here. Okay, so if. Input. Oh, God. Do the thumb. Yes. Why are you not auto feeling it? Is it because it's wrong already? Action. Pressed. Oh. 
It is not auto filling anything, which makes me think that I'm doing everything wrong. Input not declared in current scope. It is a doll here, right? Yeah. What do you mean? Uh, I put it in the map. Okay, if I do attack, because I've done attack over there. Uh, do you know what I'm talking about? Oh, damn it, it's a big eye. So this pounder works. Even though this pounder is in store. No. Oh, this pounder. Wait, where is this pounder actually? Isn't that? Is this pounder script? Oh, here it is. Oh, it's in main tow. Okay. It has its own, yeah, of course it has its own script. But the star. So should the star be here? No. No. So we've done that, but it doesn't work. Whenever I try to do to use how do I use the function? How do I call the function in another in another place? Wait, where was I right now? Oh I'm still in mouse. Okay, I don't want to be in mouse though. I want it to be here. I forgot I want it to be here. Alright, function ready. Okay, function process. Tell the flows. Should I be here or should I do another one? I don't know, I'll do another one. Bank process. There you go. No. Come on. I know, don't panic. That's okay. I am indenting. Oh, I shouldn't indent here. Okay. Feel better? Well, yeah, well, I'm gonna say something. Okay, you happy now? I don't know what that is. Warning. A new parameter. I don't know. I don't know what to tell you.
still doesn't work. Oh my gosh. Why? Why wouldn't you? It's just like I'm asking you to... <coughs> asking you to click. I'm just asking you to click. I have done the input stuff. If the input is pressed and you made it play, you know, it's like... Come on. Don't die. Right? Because I already like said that something should happen. Right? Should I save? No play. Nothing happens. Can I change that to left mouse? You know what left mouse is? Still no. Okay. Um I mean the story does have a collision shape. And it's turned on. Okay. So, what if we turn the store into a button? That's what I was thinking about the other day. Okay, does that mean that if I click it? Hello! Hello. Oh, wait, I forgot. Dama was supposed to be the, the moderator for today. I give Dama the moderator when he comes back. <coughs> Hello, Kifo. How's it going? That's a good story, but now it doesn't matter where the mouse input is. The, the mouse input doesn't work to start with, so... Okay, does that change something? I mean, I can't even see! Why? So that's the button. I'm trying to move it, it's not... There you go. Okay, so if we do the button like that... Okay, it's like the collision shape, right? There's no like different shape for the button. That's a button, but well, hide it later. Yeah.
Yeah, I know, I know, it's gonna be fine. It's just it should give me like an option to hide it. That's okay. We'll see that in the in the later. So instead of that, we're gonna do if button. Is pressed? I don't know. Okay, it doesn't like it. It's not found. Yeah, it's not found. Button dot is pressed. Does that work? Oh, damn it. I don't do the lay. Yeah. But I want it to hide after it's pressed. Like, it doesn't show on the next icon. That's okay. <coughs> Maybe not? Pressed! Okay. <coughs> Wait, what, why is not Okay, there you go. Okay. So, now... Now, now there's that. On button pressed, okay. That's the one. On button pressed. Die. Okay, maybe not like that. Maybe. On button pressed. Die. See, that's the one. Hi. Too many arguments. Expected zero. On button. Okay, so he doesn't like that I do this. Okay. Then how? Then what? How? to make a listener scroll down it's there in here hidden is on but impressed isn't that a good one in your script like 23 you made the listener see it okay um pass okay also on button pressed now i can do the die one you can do your process function with yourself yeah okay We don't see it, but why don't we see it? I have to be on main for it to work. That's weird though. Okay, does that work? Yeah! Wow! Okay, it works! Oh my god. Okay, but that has to disappear after after afterwards. Not bad, thank you. 
Only the princess will do stuff on its own. We can't make it too. Okay. Is that too much process? Okay, so now we've got that. Um but but um okay so that should work and then um theme overrides is what you want to change how it looks is it necessary oh if the visibility is off it doesn't work oh that suck oh come on work even if you are invisible like be a <coughs> be a good sport Show behind parents. Um, texture. Go to theme override and style. Theme override. Style. Theme. Theme override. Style. Invisible. Team is easier. Team. Check what the options are for team. <coughs> Gotta load it. You think we can load the animation? New team. Is this opacity? Looks complicated. I mean, if this is opacity, oh, we can't make it. Wait, it's easy, don't worry. No, I'm not worried. <gasps> that's, that's the opacity. Did that work? No, <laughs> it doesn't work. Now it has an outline. <laughs> what the hell? Okay. <coughs> um. So I don't know what that is. Um. What you see here is a preview of everything the team does, not an actual menu. Next to the preview on the left, you have a little window on the right to, for you to type. Click the plus and add a button. So you overwrite what a button looks like. You see it on the preview. I mean, oh yeah, default preview. 
Oh, here, as preview, is that what you say? Oh. Yes. Further right. Oh, yeah, right is that. Oh my gosh, right is on that side. Sorry. Oh my gosh. I keep forgetting to put like a, a note on my screen, on my monitor. That is left and right. Oh my god. Um. <clears throat> um. Here go. Add type. Okay. Is that the one we want to get rid of? Now you can make it invisible. Is it in here? Front color. To me, that is the opacity. Am I wrong? Yes, you're correct. Okay. So now it should be. That's the font. Icon. Font pressed color. Do it for all that stuff. All of them. Okay. Okay. All right. Um. No. It's still there. Um. Visibility should be the only thing to worry about though. What the hell are you being so annoying about? I need to have an outline after all. Is it because I can save? Okay, I save now. Yeah, the star is right there and ugly as, as ever. Click team again. Over here. Everything is on zero.
Is that why I should challenge actually? Icon. Is it invisible in the preview here? In the game? It is visible. I mean, don't know why it doesn't look. Can you play it? Like Come on. Nico, you could play here. See right there. And the way it did everything. And it doesn't even disappear after being pressed. We have to make it so it disappears after being pressed. Um, that shouldn't be difficult though. Um, <coughs> I'm being impressed. You play die and hide. Would that work? No, it's not working. It's not working. Or well, you can check, right? Oh wait, if it works or not. Okay, then let's do that first. In your die function, we need two things. Alright, so we need... Uh, we need the button to hide. Button. Button. Hide. Just wait. It, what, what's wrong with that? <coughs> For deleting, we put Q3 after the animation. We just queue it all. No need to change things. What? Q3 I still don't want to It returns void, what does that mean? That you're supposed to be helping but You're not really clear you Can't assign your value to a constant No one told you that it was a constant though We don't have a reference to a button, we cannot access. Oh, wait, what? I mean, the star. Well, wait. The button is here and it has a listener, so it sh isn't that reference enough? Delete all of it. All of with the old script? You want me to delete the whole script? Well, tell me first what where, where you think that's gonna go. Because I'm, I'm pretty sure it shouldn't be that difficult. It's a pretty easy, like, train of thought. It's just one thing that I should be doing right. No, please don't do that. <laughs> I was about to. Be, be, more, be more cautious with your help. <laughs> You said all of it. I was seriously about to. Then I was like, okay, I'm gonna use my brain and maybe not. I told you to just put in carefree, nothing else. And you put in button. Oh, well, cause you know. Felt like. How, how does he know? How does he know?
Oh, but now it disappeared for it disappeared before it plays. At least now we can see if it's actually doable. <laughs> I'm playing the game. <laughs> it's not right, but I'm playing it. Whoa. I wanna play until I die. Wait. Oh, I should have lost that one. If the animation is over, you should stop spam. Oh, well, I'm losing. Okay, well, that's a game I would love to play. <laughs> okay, I'm listening. I told you to put in Q3, nothing else. I need to put in button. Yeah, so I put Q3. That's a problem. That's why we need two things. Okay. We need two things. So. So. If. Something if here. Oh, wait. Get tree. Create timer. Here? Before we do it, before we do it, what? Which one of code deletes it? Which one of code deletes what? Q3? Do we need to be here? Seconds. Okay, so how many seconds? 0 0.2. See so if it deletes, it can't do stuff. Yeah, so... <laughs> so we need to do that. Not in here, but in here. No? Oh, wait. Because then the animation is not playing. So if we do that, it goes away and then the animation plays. That would just mean instant delete as soon as it spawns. <laughs> you are right. How did you know? Why do I not know? Oh my god. Okay. It's a bit tight. Yeah, it is. So... How long is the... I'm waiting till you realize. Oh my god. How long is the animation? The animation is like... Two seconds, not even that. 1.5. Oh my god. Did I realize it, Kifo? Is that right? Perfection? Oh my gosh. Just think it's a 1.6 though. <laughs> okay, okay. So, alright, so that works. 
But we need something. So for the win one, when the when the story is not clicked. Is there a thing like if else or something like that? I still haven't really understood that lesson. Let's check the theme one more time. It should be pretty. Um, It's over here. Feel the settings? Yeah, there's a lot of settings. Wait, what that is for? Oh, what that is for? Is that for a sound? Option button has many options. Oh. I'm gonna do that just in case. Oh, that's cool. What's under dot C? separation the horizontal space between button icon and text okay there's nothing here I think that one maybe but like it's empty if we click it there should be nothing then that oh my gosh this is so complicated to make it normal The visibility thing should have worked the way I want it. Now it's just being annoying for nothing. Just do stuff for the woman. It's easier. Not a lot. Okay, there's still one thing here. Everything else has appeared, but that... Which one is that? There you go. Everything is gone. Saving. Yeah, it's gone. And it works! Wah! Hi, Papi Rizalo. Hi! Hey, Papi. Yeah, we've done it, Kifa. We've done it. There is no way it is that complicated though. There should be a way to make this way easier. All right, so now that we've got that, for the win, Um, is there a way to say in computer language, if not clicked, 
when this happened. Unbutton pressed died. So, well, there should be a timer on the button. So that if the button isn't pressed after a while, then the other animation plays. One last program to solve the win. Yeah, I can't watch for long, unfortunately. <laughs> Don't worry, Papyrus. I'm so glad you're here. But it's not gonna be a lot of fun. It's mostly trying to think and make things happen. Do you know how to call the Papyrus? Okay, so on button pressed, it dies. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Maybe there's a thing. Maybe there's a thing. On um, button not pressed. Uh, button down up pressed There's no button up pressed uh, Let me ask first Is the idea that once the star wins Or star at the same time Do the win animation? Yes I want it to look super creepy or do they really want to show win after a second time? After a second time? What do you mean a second time? Okay, first one is way easier. Yeah, I mean, in my head I made the easiest game in the world. <laughs> it's not my fault that it's so complicated to make the easiest game in the world. Okay, so button down, button up. Image when the button starts being held down. But I'm pressed. Toggled. Okay. Currently, because we are in a sub scene, our problem is that we can't communicate with our game. Well, that's the last big thing we need to change. Um, okay, I don't really understand, but okay. So, I think if we do... If we just wait... That... It's like, it's the same amount of time, it's 1.6 seconds. I think, or maybe less. What we want the star to do is ask the game if the star is one, once. Okay, Kifal and Papyrus, since it's just us here right now, I wish I could code, oh my gosh, I wish I could code too. Guys, I can tell you the whole game and the story that I have behind it, if you want. I can tell you the whole narrative so that you know where it goes from here. Maybe that will help you in the future. <laughs> Um, so the narrative, the narrative, so the narrative is, the story is born, and when it's clicked, the star dies, but if it's not click, the star wins, see? So by the end of the first game, because there is no other way the game could the, the player could win, the screen will be filled with this. And then, cutscene. I gotta learn how to do cutscene, by the way. I'm gonna work on that, it's gonna be okay. Then the story starts talking. The story's like, you thought you could do this, didn't you? I'm confident you will like this. We just created a good, a, a god now. That does everything for us. Go to main scene. Well, I'm I'm telling you a story. I don't want a story. I don't want, I don't want a story. Okay. Alright. No story. We go to main scene. Sorry. It's okay. <laughs> Story's good. You want a story? Okay. Finish the story. Alright. I'm just a puppet to you. <laughs> I'm just a puppet tail. Okay, I'm finishing the story. The story starts talking and tells the player 
You thought you could win, but this is not the end. We will win at the end. That's the start, being super confident and stuff, and looking evil and stuff. So the player feels entitled, you know? The player feels entitled and the player is going to harm itself. There is the first weapon here. And the second weapon, and the third weapon, and the fifth weapon, all of that will show. First weapon, idol. You have a little idol animation. So that will be the mouse. That will be the mouse. The, the player harmed, harms himself with a super galactic fluid that will kill the spider. The second one is when the player attacks. I have a little, a little animation again. When click, it does that. It's cute. So in the second level, after the little stars um, you know, speech. The stories will see the player armed himself with a super fluid and the story will protect itself. It will show as the story is evolving into different types of stories. So the player is going to try and kill the star, but the fluid is only going to work on some of them, not on all of them. So at the end, the player will lose again. On level 3, uh, let me check, I wrote it somewhere. <laughs> give me a sec, give me a sec. I put a note in my phone. Okay, on level 2, the star becomes organized, which means the player will change weapon. The player will take... Um, for the organized one, the player will take, uh, wait, what was it again? I don't remember if I wanted to use a ruler or, or, you know, a fly trap, you know, the little fly stuff that you, you fly, you kill a fly with it. So you organize them like that, the stories are going to show in different types of color and you will have to grab the right flappy thingy to kill a star. But you will lose again because obviously you can't react fast enough. On the fourth one, it's gonna be a pattern. You're going to have to use magic. You're going to organize the star in a pattern to make constellations. And when you have the right stories placed at the right place, there's going to be in the background something that shows where it should go. The story will implode. But by imploded, they will multiply and the player will lose again. On the level 5, that's the funny one. On the level 5, we're going to have... I forgot what it's called. Mega little mix or something like that. You know the music? The fight music in Undertale with sounds. When you click a star, there's going to be one note played. And you're going to have to kill a star in the right order. So that when you kill them, you actually play the music. <laughs> if the right order is met, then you start losing. And then you start winning, sorry. And then another cutscene. And the star talks to you again. And says, why are you doing that? You came here to begin with and started killing all of us. And we tried to defend ourselves and to evolve, but you still tried to kill all of us. Why are you doing this? And then... The story starts multiplying really quickly. But this time, it's a, it's a reverse multiplying, which means that there's a ton of stories on the screen, but as you click them, they disappear and they don't. They don't come back. And that's when you realize the stars were good stars and you are the bad person destroying the stars in the sky. And the last frame will be super dark instead of being a blue, uh, a blue sky with pink clouds. It's going to be super, super dark. Story is pretty middle so far. Yeah, kind of something like that. 
So that's a six level thing. That's a little bit story thing that you. It's kind of a game you play once. You don't come back to. Yeah. So that's a little story I have in my head. Something. I think I had a better idea, but I forgot most of it. So I kind of rolled with it. Anyways, that's that's it. All right, you wanted me to come back to Maine. I'm in here. I'm here in Maine. No, I'm not. Here I am. So I did what you asked me here, but I nothing happened. So yeah. Cookie. Gotta go. Okay, Peppers. Thank you for stopping by. Have a good day. I'm eating a cookie right now. Guess what flavor it is? It's not spaghetti. Anyway, nothing is set in stone. I might change my mind on, on a few things, but just so you know what kind of like progression is gonna be. Bye bye, Peppers. Make a new script. Where do you want me to make it? I can be here. Yeah, that didn't work. But if I do that, it's got to be linked to something. I can't just have a script flying around. It's got a script of the mine and a script of the spell now. In the middle. Here? Oh. So we can have a script that is not attached to a scene or to a node? This will be our god. Okay. It's usually you call your manager. I suggest we call it Oristia. Well, same thing. I just call it God. It's the same as Oristia. <laughs> okay. Good. Okay. Oh, I had no idea you could just start uh, create scripts like that. This will be an autolog. Singleton. I came across that word in one of the tutorials, but I'm not sure where I was. I thought a singleton was someone who was single. You will always exist, never get deleted. We can always use it. Okay. Which means any object in the game at any moment can always ask God what's up. Alright. So put in variables we want to accept. Um, what do we want to access? We kind of want that, right? Bar win equal false. My bad. So 
So the story is just ask God if winning cool too and then smile. Okay. Maybe I kinda get it, yeah. Now we won the number of stars clicked, right? Yeah. That's the score, right? So name it whatever you want. Star score equal the amount of dead, right? So amount of button pushed. How do we call that? Equals button dot dot pressed. <laughs> Just make it zero, okay? We use functions to access God. We use function, yeah? So simple score increase function. We'll just do score plus plus. What does that mean? make that ourself oh my gosh it's getting cold again I'm going to bed myself from using the heater until November but I'm using it in September this is crazy okay so we made that ourselves um it got quite cool here too <laughs> really oh my god wait it's crazy though I've never used the heater in September my whole life and now I got to use it this is crazy I haven't even opened the window today but it's still cold This infrastructure sucks. Okay, so score equal no. But I'm on button pressed. On button pressed. Um. Is it score dot on button pressed? Plus equal one. Is this correct? Score plus equal one works too. God does not listen to anyone. Really? So we do not put any references in here. Oh, really? Well, then how does he know them? How is it gonna know that it needs to be pressed before we get something? God is pure, God just does the important stuff, okay. Forget buttons and stories, none of that. Button talk to God instead. But God doesn't listen? Okay, alright. Does it make sense? Uh, because we won't know where our stories in the game are later. But everyone always knows where God is. So 
We're going to have to reference God in all of them instead of referencing all of them into God. Is that what that means? So every object can just do God stuff, but God doesn't have every single reference. That would be overkill. Okay. All right. Seems like it's more work to have to reference God everywhere rather than referencing everything inside of God. I'd rather have like a three pages score like script here and nothing in there. <laughs> but maybe that's not efficient. Maybe I'm wrong about that. I guess I see what you mean. Yeah. I think everything in the same place to me feels better with a little bit here and there. It doesn't work because we delete objects, basically. Okay. Because that script can't know where stuff is later. Hmm. I'm not 100%, but I think I got most of it. <laughs> Make a reset function. We need that if uh, we have a second level. A reset function. All right. Your whole story planned. Okay. Good enough for now. Alright. Go to project setting. Save God first. Here you go. to load auto on startup is that what you want To original to long start, no description available. That's helpful. On auto on start. What does that mean? That's not it. What are you trying to do? Can you tell me first? That's global, nothing. It's right there. Oh, loud. Oh, that's right here. <laughs> okay, I, I was looking at everything else. So what do we want here? Um, click path Our God
There you go. Can you tell me what's happening now? What is this for? Perfect. Okay. This means that every time the game starts, it puts God in there. No matter whatever else happens, it just has it. Okay. Automatically lost. Okay. Shouldn't that be the main stuff though? Should I just delete that? Oh wait, I'm not main. The main here. Is this unnecessary anymore? We did a label and everything for a score. So now we got to our store. Okay. So can you tell me the plan you have? When the story dies, it just tells God, that's all. Oh, hello from oh, back from Boston. You know what, because of you, I went ahead and got a super expensive cookie. It was a chocolate and pistachio cookie. It was so good. It's all because of you. <laughs> Hi from oh, hello, welcome back from Boston. I'll come back to Jupiter. So we can access that everywhere. So main doesn't really matter anymore, is that right? I thought main would be God. Hello. Hello, hello. Wait, what is Boston known for? I thought Boston was known for pizza, but you weren't there for chocolate. But you want to do more on one level? Yeah, 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 yeah. So main is just going to be for the first level? Then you have different main games. In oh, really? But still only one god. Okay, I was not intending to make it complicated, so... The scene is always going to be looking like this. This is always going to be the background until the last one where all the stories are going to disappear. God really just saves the super super basic stuff. It doesn't process anything. Oh yeah, we didn't do any processing God. Okay. So... What next? Boston is known for throwing tea into the harbor? <laughs> Are you serious? That's the, that's the most random thing ever. Why would people do that? Like tea that is good or like tea you drunk the tea and you throw out the remaining leaves into the harbor just because? Does the fish like that? Got that score increase when star dies. Okay. So, score increase. God, that. Wait, where, where do I. Do I do a new function? Is it a new function? Wait, I have to go back to star, right? I forgot. I'm back in star. Or. Yeah. The star does things. Okay, okay, okay. When star dies, okay. When star dies, here. Um. God does. Score. Increase. Parenthesis. Okay, it doesn't like this. Identifier God is not declared. That happens to me all the time. How do you not know God? I'm saving. How do you not know the God? Big G. 
Really? I don't remember putting a big G. Look at that. It's not big G. Oh! Seriously? But I didn't put a big G in the guard. Huh? You call it that in the auto manual. I don't remember putting a big G. Okay, my bad. Alright! Okay, so when the story dies, there is an animation play. There's a timeout. There's a Q3. And now we've got a score going on. That's awesome. Right now, it doesn't do line 12. Because it's deleted. Better? Yeah! Awesome. And now we change the label. Alright. Put the score God says in there. Should we do something like score like that? But you can just use God that score. Probably not in here, right? Um, should I put a script in the label then? In the code. So in main, wait, I'm waiting, we had that in main didn't we exactly, yeah, so is it in process, score number equals god dot score, good? in process score dot text equal god dot score this other score is a reference to the label okay so i put that back to zero Maybe it will work if I do score and score number. Now that should call to the variation. Yeah. 
Um, let's have a look here. Score equals zero. Is it because here we have score equals zero, but here we have score a number? Let's bring it back to. Oh. So maybe we don't need that. Nope, maybe we did need that. We use a reference this time. Okay. So in God we have score plus zero. Score increase, score plus one. But God doesn't know about the label, does it? Put in the code. In here? Score dot... Where did it go? No, in main? Um, score dot text equal... any code in here right we can't make it the code <sighs> in my experience when something is gray it means that the computer doesn't know what it is I'm ready score label texture rec score I think that score number here is confusing it. Um, maybe a label text? Label is not declared. Seriously? Well, yeah, it is. Oh, no, it is. Oh. That's what a third generator didn't. That must be God. Set text. Let's use that. Okay. Score dot set text. Hmm. 
I know, right? That's how I feel every time I open that up. Picture not reacting. Can't we write it in here? not linked to the score somehow but also how does the computer know what the score is we haven't said anything shouldn't we do a little oh one of those <laughs> yeah right now right mm -hmm. score at all times that's a beauty the label doesn't accept our changes but i mean does it really know what score means because it's in gray everything important is always in color the label doesn't accept our changes we can't access got that score anywhere because it's auto loaded right but like does god knows what square means because we did square equal zero but it doesn't know that score equal when we click the stuff score equal button clicked button on on button pressed it's just how it's displayed your value of walls work the story does that for us. The story tells God when it does. And then it has a higher score. Okay. And that's saved forever. Okay. I need a little bit more 
cookie. I don't have the Dubai chocolate, I have the pistachio cookie. They are not good. It's savory and it's sweet at the same time. And it's chocolatey and it's pissed and chilly. Score number equals. I just hit myself and got and it works. Let me see your level. Even when I didn't do it. No, it's working. Wait, it works for you? It doesn't work for me? What the hell have I done? There's a few bugs if you want to know. Depressing. Um, that's on the mouse script. Okay, we can just do like that later. the label and make a new one? Okay. Oh, 
in the game. Oh, okay. You mean the interface? Okay. Never mind. Um, score. Is that is that a label? Well, it was visible earlier. Eek. Eek. Should we make a script in the label? Not needed? Okay. Text label. Maybe they eat those constant and other var just to be safe. It doesn't have like inspector. There's nothing here, that's weird. Does that change something? Oh, 
Oh, now we've got something. I don't think the label was the issue though. There's nothing in here. Hmm. Mm hmm I hate when it says that because there is a parenthesis, so I don't know why you're tripping like that. And it's a line 20 when there's no even a line 20. No, I'm getting a line 20. Yeah. In here? Um. You mean instead of string or string is a placeholder? Ooh. But it's still not happy about it. anything you want. Why is it still not happy about this? In quotation. Text is part of a placeholder. There we go. Works for you, huh? The hell, good heart. Why you not work for me? Maybe even though that's weird, it's trying to access God score variable instead. Rename that variable. The God score variable. Here. What do you want me to name it? Or in here? Stay in main and here. Instead of score, rename the label. Oh. Numbers. Need to remake the reference? Which reference?
I have no idea. I'll take a break. Sure, sure, sure. Go take a break. Thanks for your help. Thank you. Thank you. Anyway, let me look at all this stuff then. Couldn't be simple, right? That I would think so. <laughs> I would think so. I don't know what's wrong, but yeah. Anyway, so I want to work on the store. Wait, one more idea? Yeah? Is the manuscript even used? What the manuscript does? Well, only have the label stuff now that I deleted everything else. Do you want to delete the main script? Check the main scene. Mm -hmm. That's where we put the script on roots. Click main. All the way down. Test your mouse and your whip. Main script was not main. Mouse.gd, mouse script, not main.gd. to a normal label then. It works? Yeah! Okay, delete. Big G. 
이거 What? 30 or key tags with value of type callable on a base object of type label. I put God score in there again, like you did already. God score. Like I did already. Is it a variable? See, so you're not thinking with me. No, I'm not. <laughs> I don't know what I don't, I don't even know what that means. Var two string. God score. Shouldn't it be like quotes? We're changing the label dot text. And we just turn the number into text. Variable to string. So so that means that that is going to change the string into the score. Shouldn't there be a like quote still? We're changing the label of text. Yeah, but the label is empty. So var to string score just turns a zero into a zero because this function wants it to be a text. Okay. Or maybe yeah. So keep score the text. Oh, it's my bad. I put I was a typo. Oh, that's what. Oh, that's even worse. And then put the var to string with the god score after the equal. We delete that. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, it's over there! Oh, it is counting so slow, but it works. All right. 
Alter! Hab ich da nicht Gefahr. Okay! Yay! Ah, you can take a break, you deserve it! Thank you! It's so silly when a small reset makes it hard. Oh my god, yeah! Well, we got all the basics for the M. Yeah, we do! Wow! Good job, Kifal. Thank you so much. You basically made the game. I'm a monkey. I'm the monkey in your hand. Alright, so. Um, okay, you can take a break and I'll see what I can come up with here. A lot of the other stuff we do are also just a lot. Like when we use the input things. Okay. Or even the variety string maker. It's just an overload that Gora has by default. Okay. String. That's a good thing to know, I guess. I'm still processing it. Score dot tags equal to string dot score. So score is a label. Dot text is the text in the label that is going to be the variable that we created for the god in the god script regarding the score. And in the god script we have score equals zero. Score increase, score plus one. So that means that when we are here, nine, that does a lot because that means that the game now, I mean, Godot knows what the score is, and that God is a score equals zero, and also have a variable that is now in function that is increasing plus one. But how does it know that the plus one equals when we click on it? That is crazy to me. I don't think we've told him that. And he knows already. Or even the artist chain maker is just no. Oh yeah, I said that before. <laughs> That's um, a little complicated. But I'm sure I can figure things out, maybe. That's just a process because it checks hundreds of thousands of times. All the times, yeah. So we don't have to worry about when the variable changes. It will always check. Hmm, it's complicated. I'm glad I took like painkillers before that because I've been having a headache for three days. <laughs> I spent most of the day in my bed trying to wait for the headache to go. I was like, okay, time to go. Time to take a, he a headache pill. Oh, poor Aristilia. <laughs> I know. I haven't been taking any painkillers for the headache because I took a lot of painkillers for a period. So I was like, let's cool down on the painkillers. I was like, okay, I gotta be alert. Turns out I'm not. <laughs> but oh my gosh, it's crazy how you realize what the issue was. How did you know? It's crazy. Migraine is too? Sunlight is hard? No. I think it's the cold, maybe. The cold, because I've been freezing the past few days. I don't know. I don't know if it's a migraine though, because it's in the back of the head, not in the front of the head. I think the migraine is the one you have on the front, right? Wait, it's on the back, I don't know what it is. Maybe it is a migraine, I don't know. But no sunlight now, it's been raining the whole time. It's very cloudy around Jupiter. I saw the mask script earlier, and when I went to the toilet, I was thinking maybe I'll reset it around it. Yeah, I mean, 
how is it I just I don't know I gotta test the things and then I do stuff I uh, forget I did the stuff I didn't know how to undo because I feel like at one point there was a window that came in really quickly and I clicked something without really realizing but like I well you go be a game designer I don't know what you're wasting your time here for <laughs> I'm sorry, script was fear of mistake. I knew that. So the only reason it didn't work is that the script wasn't being used somehow. Okay. Well... <sighs> you know stuff. Oh, actually it's getting late. Um, okay, maybe just a little bit more. I'm gonna play with that a little bit more and maybe we can have the thing show up. I have been telling myself that all week again. But you're the only reason for me to get out of my cave and do it. Well... Just do it though. Try and recreate a game that you liked before and put a little twist on it. Cause I like helping you. More like being a depressed potato. The potato game has been made on, on here. On Godot. That means... It has like, you know... <laughs> Try and make your favorite game or something. The better of a game developer you become, the better you'll be able to help me. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. But you obviously have the knowledge to do stuff. You should go ahead and do it. You even can draw, your art is really cute. Okay, actually. Here. Can I remember in time of one and this is time of two? Okay, on timer to time out. Can I do that? No. That would be too good. I wanted to finish again though. Can we just make one more thing? I know it's not how you want it, it starts to feel a little screen. But let's make this story win either 30 of them because it's easy. Okay. But I want to make that first. Does that make sense to you? We just need God to know how many stories, so God gets the variable stories. Okay. Um, I'm processor already. That's only level one, though. The other levels will be different. Neither. Okay. At the top. I. Right.
What's that shit here? Mission is in the bracket. Okay, done. Done. Okay. What? Oh, he doesn't like how I did that. Hmm. Yeah, he shouldn't be clickable after it's done. Okay, I'm gonna work on that too. Okay. I'll wait till we have the restore. Okay. I think I hate too much cookie. I'm starting to have a stomach cake, but the cookie is too good. for stomach y'all the most expensive cookie I've ever gotten though and it's actually delicious mm. 
I see what you did. But I would rather have them show the animation every time, not just at the end. Yeah, yeah, I'm on the gender tag, don't worry. Wait, it wasn't on Hoopo. Yeah, for each store. Here. Oh, fuck that. Here, each star. If I don't click it, here the animation plays. But you know when you're trying to win, which one is the star that you can still click. Because once it's fully grown like that, it shouldn't be clickable still. The button should not be working, it should be the evil face and that you'll know which star you can't click anymore. You can only click the growing ones. So that you know you have to hurry or you're gonna lose. So they become unclickable, yeah. That's why I try asking out if you start winning individually or all together. I still do a little slightly more work. Yeah, I feel like I could figure it out. And I don't know why it's on the loop, because it's not on the loop. It's not on the loop here. Yeah, I deactivated the loop for all of them. Hmm? You know? It's because Princess tells them to win a lot of times. Oh, okay. It's time playing the animation once. Okay. Um. Too much work. Don't worry, I'll figure it out. You can go and take a break and I'll figure it out. I'm just gonna chill here and try to make my brain work a little bit. And then maybe in half an hour I'll stop streaming. Because then we're gonna have, if it's a losing situation, we're gonna have a new animation that I haven't done yet. You see why God is useful here? All the stars have a common friend to ask what's up. Imagine Miss God would need a reference to each individual story story in it. Yeah, that's true. As people get huge. Yeah, I see what you've done here.
can't see you. What's that? We need to put the timer on the button anyways. Um, can we put the timer on the button? Color applied. I don't care about the color. Button timer. Is there a thing like disable the button? Disable mode. Does that mean something? I can't assign new value to the button. Well, it's not like I want a new value. I want him to do something. Disabled. Disabled. Do the thing. Disabled. No. Um. Okay. What do you call it? Visibility. Oh, visibility false. <gasps> visibility false.
Not declared? But you're supposed to know! Button not visibility? Why? It's written right here! Visible! Visible in tree must be done true. If true, the canvas might be strong. No, it's not visible. Okay, is visible in tree. Is visible in tree. Oops. Oh, there's a new value to the constant. The button is a constant? I don't see a constant here. Clip shield. Oh, come on! You're the one telling me the words! Why are you telling me it doesn't mean anything? Not declared current scope. This is a timer on the button. And the timer is set to 1.2. Isn't it good enough already? <gasps> Wait a minute. What if I just do that? It's always going to show, even if I click here. That's not what I want. Yeah, because now those two here. So... <sighs> so, on button press it dies. On button timer timer when put a reference to a button like we did. The way you'll have the ability to tell it to do things. That's right, I don't know when button timer though. I put a timeout in 1.2. Oh, I hit 1.2 it when it went back to 1. Um, and I did one shot. Wait. Why are you undoing the stuff that I tell you to do? Put a reference. Isn't that the reference though? Because I did the little thingy here. Wait a minute. Why am I on main? I shouldn't be here. Where? Oh, am I on the right? Um, maybe I'm on the wrong button. Why is this timer for again? Oh my god. 
I'm not on the right. I'm not on the right thing. There you go. Button timer. <laughs> That's the one. What? Yeah, I was here. I was here in the right place, but I was here in the wrong place. That's so weird. Um, well, I hope I didn't break anything. In the meantime, in the meantime, um. Wait, wait a minute. There you go. Um, okay, so... Button timer, time out. We want to win and we want to disable the button. So the button becomes false. Yeah, yeah, I didn't really think so. Mm. I think you would be really good at coding with an AI helper. If you understand what you want to do, it will translate into the right comments. Yeah, but it feels like every creative pe person in the whole world is fighting the AI. I would feel like I would be cheating though. Only the, the money, money hungry people are after the AI. Everyone else is like, let's do our own stuff, let's not make the robot do it for us. <laughs> like, await Starborn, I know exactly what you want to do. But we would need to ask the animation if it still plays because only we know the Starborn even is. Well, it knows what it is. Go reset it here. I mean, anybody would be able to code with an AI, just like anybody is able to draw with an AI. AI is doing things that people don't know how to do. Cheating. Seriously, nothing in the button here. Show me the no, button inspector. Come on, show me button inspector. There you go. Isn't there something in here? Voice piggy. Plenty of people look at this and don't even know what they want to do. I mean, okay, fair. In 20 years, maybe encoding with AI is like image creation and you would just put fireworks. Yeah, exactly. It's cheating. I hope I won't be there in 20 years. I want to say if button isn't pressed on timer, timeout, play. Animation, store win. So, on button press die. 
Um, bed and timer, time out. Eve, bed and pressed win. That's, that's the only thing I have in my head right now, but I don't know how to say it in code. Eve. Uh, um, button timer time out. Disable the button. But that did a lot. Missing up on everything. It's not what I want to do. Since we do just delete everything, you can just have it win after a timer is done. But we need to disable the button. I'm trying to. So just have a reference to the button. And when timeout disable and win. I'm trying to do on timer timeout disable, but it doesn't want to. I said button false, button disable, visibility false, I've tried everything. Is that a thing? Changed. Not false. No. Equal false. No. Change. <sighs> the girl doesn't know what the button is. Doesn't understand what you're talking about. Oh, me neither. Okay, I gotta go to the bathroom because I ate too much cookie. And then I'm gonna take a shower and I'm gonna watch Only Murders in the Building because that's a great show. <laughs> I'll keep working on that as usual during the week, but probably will only amount to errors and mistakes. So I'll see you. There next Sunday again. <laughs> um, yeah, I'll see you next Sunday again. I hope let's read. Oh no, 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 no! I'm not gonna be reading anymore, and I, I'm hopefully not gonna be getting any more raids because I'm not entertaining anybody by doing that. I'm just doing this for myself. So I'd rather keep this on the low key. If that's okay with you. Um. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's only going to be a little. If that's how you feel, yeah. Have a good shot. Oh, yeah, thank you. Yeah, it's just going to be a little quiet thing for us. I'm not gonna be trying to grow a channel anymore, so there's no reason to wait. Just going to try and make a game. Once it's out there, then I will spread it to everybody. Imagine if there is another drama and people out there. <laughs> well, there was a a Leo, a Leo, Leo cam on the first developing stream. Maybe one day I'll come back, and they would become your best friend just because they don't know you. <laughs> well, I've been doing it for more than a year, Kifal, a year and a half. I guess I have all the dramas in the kibble that I can get now. <laughs> oh, Frenchie, hello! 
I'm so late. <laughs> that's okay. <laughs> the stream wasn't really long today. Love ya. Oh, that's so nice. Thank you, Frenchie. Thank you. When the game is ready, you'll be the first one to know. <laughs> yeah. Okay, for one day get once the game is ready and I know what I'm doing, I'll let people know about it. Right now it's just like yeah, I just mm. <laughs> Anyway, thanks everyone. Thank you, friends. Thank you, Kifal. Thanks for everybody who dropped in today. It was fun for me. Bye. Bye, Frenchy. Bye. Thank you, Kifal, for helping. One day, I'll understand, I'll understand everything that I'm doing and I'll be able to recreate it properly. One day, maybe. It's, it's really hard. Anyways, let's not dwell onto that. Oh, sure. Thank you. The stream was amazing. I'm still really looking forward to the red panda. <laughs> really looking forward to the red panda, Alison. But take your time with it. Anyway, we want the care. Have a wonderful rest of your night, morning, afternoon. Don't dusk and all that's in between. I'll see you on August time. Bye bye. Bye 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 bye.